But the first time, mm -hmm. um, not the first time, but the second time, uh -huh. I battled T-Rex. Uh -huh. um, Swag was putting up all the bread for the battles. No, T-Rex is the dude with the, the pimple right there? <laughs> <laughs> no, that's how I identified it. It's not a pimple, but you know, okay, yeah, right, yeah, that, that, that joint. Mm -hmm. And I battled Averb. Uh -huh. I, the Averb battle was next. Smack ran into you. Okay. And you introduced that battle. Mm, okay. Now, going back, uh -huh. understanding... Uh -huh. CNN war report, uh -huh. war report, uh -huh. channel 10 blood uh -huh. sport, like oh, uh -huh. every day. Then uh -huh. NRRE drops uh -huh. and a huge fan. Uh -huh. And I see that. He puts it out on YouTube. Uh -huh. And I'm like, yo, you know, uh -huh. you know this Noriega, uh -huh. uh, uh, Capone was with you. He was uh -huh. lit. He was super lit. Uh -huh. but he must he have was, just came home. Yeah, he was super lit. Uh -huh. and he was like, yo, Yo, I'm gonna introduce this battle. This mm -hmm. my man Matt Hoffa versus mm -hmm. Yo, I was so hyped, bro. <laughs> that's I was dope. so hyped. That's dope. Bro. That's dope. So that's, hyped. That's dope. Cause that's I always beautiful. thought I always thought your battle rappers be like in your own league sometimes and be like not not recognizing how how much that we think y'all heroes. You know what I'm saying? Like right. because like I said, like it's a different type, it's a different type of restraint, different type of uh, uh humbleness. Right. And it's a different type of also arrogance too, because for you to let somebody talk to you in your face, you gotta know I'm coming back. I'm coming back. So like, so that's arrogant too. So like I always just admire that. Like I just always was like, I just feel like y'all tougher than me. You know what I'm saying? I y'all feel like I feel like y'all tougher than every rap. So 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 you look, you look at this as strength. Yeah. I look at it as strength, yeah. Being from the hood, mm -hmm. knowing like mm -hmm. How easy it is for shit to just go left, especially when y'all start spitting. <laughs> like you know when y'all can't control y'all spit, and it's just you know like when I was just looking at the move shit, I was like, damn homie, like he got. It did look like Tay Rock was. Tay Rock was. It like he was extra spitting, or unless, <laughs> unless the camera had an ill light on him, yeah. like it was just like. To the point he got damn near wiped your face, like ah. Right, yeah. 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 Like, let this shit go for that. Yeah. yeah. Mm -hmm. Especially if you winning, if you winning. <laughs> And it's like the dude baiting you. Yeah, he's baiting you to try to, to, I can, try to get, I get up out it, of there. I get it, man. As far as like pure ability and mm -hmm. lyricism and things like that, how do you see battlers? Like some battles might be like, we the best rappers in the world. But industry niggas would be like, we the best. Like, right. We're the industry, nigga. We done made millions. But battle yeah. rappers would be like, nigga, we go through the shit and right. we have to come up with this like, shit. I, 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 we did I, the I last agree. episode. I agree. I, I had this dude, Mac Myron, on there. And he was like, if Jada Kiss ever battle, mm. I kill Jada Kiss. And I'm sitting there like, and there's a lot of dudes that was in a building that's battle rap fans who was like, nah. Right. And I'm like, um, I don't know. This is kind of in between because this is what we do. I'm gonna tell you like this. Jada would probably beat a lot of battle rappers in lyrics, but showmanship, he ain't got it. I'm that's not this is my friend now. Right. It's a certain type of showmanship that y'all got. It's just like the Joe Buttons. Joe Buttons is a perfect example. Mm -hmm. Like, I believe Joe has lyrics. Oh, yes. Yeah. But when he stood up there, if y'all am not going to be quiet, I'm not going to finish. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. You lost. That's not battle rap. You That's lost. not battle rap. Right That's not. it. You know, Joe, again, Joe's my friend. And the battle rap fans, it's, being who they are, they booed him for that. It's the showmanship. And then what's my man name? He Hollow. just took he just took full advantage of that. Yeah. He don't have to sit around and say, look what he's doing wrong. He picked up the mic right. and it was like, I'm sorry, bro. Even even if I had Smoke. it two to one at that right. point, if even if I had it two to one, the minute he put down the mic, I would have three zip. Yeah, yeah. Mm. I changed the whole battle card. Facts. Because, and it's not Joe Fall. Again, we as 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 people who is artists, we think it, it's lyrics, yeah. right? But it's the showmanship Shit. that come with. That's like that's like what I said. Like I love when motherfuckers be like, doo -doo 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 -doo, and they be like, and the crowd be like, oh, they be like, hold up, like, hold up, hold up, hold up, because he, he's hype and he's getting the yeah. crowd, and then he yeah. hit the bar again, and then like you like yo, like that's that should get me hype. You know what I'm yeah. saying? Yeah. So, so that's the problem. Um, and like again, it's about the showmanship. And that's something, unfortunately, in battle rap, you can't teach. Mm. You got to go through that's, it. You, that's an experience. Now, you now, can't, now, this is something that I hear you on that. You can teach that? I hear you I'm, on I'm, that. I'm saying, you can practice to get better. But for a seasoned artist just... that's been 20 years in the game as an artist, yeah. it's hard for that man to go back and, and, and like, I think Eminem I you lyrically that. could beat a lot of people, but I but think the showmanship. On, the showmanship is going to kill him, bro. So I just battled Method Man. 
Mm-hmm. I seen Chelsea. It was a respectful battle. It was respectful. Yeah. It, 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 was, it wasn't. It wasn't. It, was it friendly, wasn't that raw. Friendly, it wasn't. Yeah. It was. It, even though y'all did take shots at each other, right? But I could tell y'all friends. You know what I'm saying? Right. Like I could tell y'all friends now. <laughs> all right, you battle. All right, that you never met. Damn, I, I'm trying to figure out a person you never met. I'm thinking. You ever met E40? No. Great example. Right. Two different coasts. Mm-hmm. Y'all never meet each other. Your respect for E40 is going to be there as a vet, but mm-hmm. you're also going to want to win. Right. So you also might go Google some information that might not be correct, but you're going to use it to get this battle. Right. It's going to be a different level of respect. Mm-hmm. Now, E40 will have to do the same exact thing. Yeah, he will right. say, yo, I respect math, but... And that's what it will boil down to. It, w- it can't boil down to lyrics because we all got that. The thing is, it's about how you correct the stage. Now, most of us know how to say, put your hands in the air. You don't care. We don't know how to be like, yo, yo, did you hear what I said? Bear, 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 bear. That's a different thing. You know what I'm saying? Poor bear, poor bear, poor bear. Because like, poor bear, poor bear. That shit right there is like, because we, we're not used to that. We're used to 16s. We're right. not used to making this stretch right. where to where as everything is entertaining and sometimes mm. the shit that goes over your head is even entertaining. But so, it's even the mannerisms you use. But now, you but, now but now, but now, if you say, all right, let's go in and make a record with them. Mm. Now the artist has an advantage because the showmanship might be different on the record. Fact. Now I could be like, I can do the same showmanship on a record, mm-hmm. but you know I punched in. Mm. Right. You understand? Yeah. You know, I, you know, I couldn't have did that. I put a helicopter in my verse. But you know, you but understand? It's, but it's kind of the same thing because you know we went in the studio first. Oh, that's how y'all remember our raps? No, um, no, for me and Meth. Okay. We hit the studio first. Okay. We recorded it. Okay. And then we shot see, it. It's kind of like different. That's, that's different. See, that's different. That's different. See, see, yeah, yeah, yeah. So yeah, it's 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 battle rap, little cousin. Yeah, Which I did. Hey, <laughs> hey. little cousin, you know what I'm saying? That's, little, that's the first thing you know, I told him when I heard it. I said, y'all being real step, friendly. That's the first but, step. but this little cousin, could you see like other yes, rappers? I can see, I can see it, but like I said, there would have to be two people who don't know each other who have to actually do some investigation. Mm. Like you and Meth also have records together. Right. You know what I'm saying? So it would have to be two rappers, who uh, a rapper slash battle rap. Mm-hmm. Like it would have to be like... I'm gonna tell you something, like and they, and they might know. Me? They might know something like a murder mook versus like a Royce the Five Nine. Mm. You know what I'm saying? Where you know they know each other, but Royce understands the culture, and Royce knows that Murk is gonna talk about your mother. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> right. Royce knows that. You know right. what I'm saying? Right. And and Royce should talk about Mook's mother. You know right. what I'm saying? I don't know if anybody's mother is dead. I'm just giving an example. So God bless yeah, you. Yeah, 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 yeah. do, right. do you think it's also harder for the industry guys? Because when you come into the battle rap world. These fans are not just your fans like that. Yeah, like yeah. You if you don't impress them, yeah. Nori, you the shit. And I don't get they'll like, boo the shit out of you because they'll yeah. be like, yo, Nori, yo, nah, get, nah, I, nah, tell nah. You, I tell you what, you told me if I do a versus, yeah, but would I ever have a battle rap? Hell yeah, no. Like, no, no. Hey, let me tell you something. I sent you the clip. Hell you no. You remember what you said when I, I, sent, when I sent you the link? Said, well, I forgot. Tell me. Move on. He was like, yo, you was like, yo, that's fire, but I will never do that shit. No, because even when it's friendly, even when it's friendly, it's still harmful, right? Yeah. And the thing about it, like I said, that's some thick skin. Like, like you gotta really like like. See now, this is confusing for me because you go in the studio I, and, and I you go try on Twitter, to kill and I go on Twitter. Whoever's yeah, it's a, it's a, it's a difference because it is different because you killing on, on a track, you killing right. them with lyrical ability, right? In a battle, you killing them with yeah. personal. But you still yeah. gonna kill them. You still trying to kill them. Trying to you trying to make everybody say you had the best yeah. verse better and they were slapping. Yeah, right. still trying. But yeah, but battle rap is different. That's a whole different. Yeah. That's um, like at the end of the day, like I, I'm used to going on stage to impress the crowd. You guys gotta go on stage, impress the crowd, and outdo your opponent oh, yes. at the same time. Mm-hmm. Yes, and still be entertaining. Mm-hmm. I think y'all gonna be doing that too. I don't think. I don't think. No, I, when, when this thing is over, yeah. those okay. verses, those verses things gonna hit Madison Square Garden. I, I believe so. That's like, I, I believe I believe if Buster would have did a verses, I believe Buster would have performed all his records and he would have beat anybody. Mm. I don't think he would have let his records just play. I mean, I mean, he's in the Guinness Book of World yeah. Records. Yeah, I think, he would've, I think he would. I think he would have been. You know, to, but but I do <laughs> see the verses like when COVID is done. Yeah, these are gonna be concerts. 
Well, that's what yeah, that should um, be fire. That's what Swiss wants to do with Diddy, right? Oh, I don't know. Yeah, I don't know. with Diddy and, and um, he wants Diddy to versus Jermaine Dupree. Dr. Dre. Dr. And he Dre. Wants to that's do crazy. That. I would love that. That's Listen, crazy. Listen, by the way, versus by the way, right there. If he put on Outcast, the what is it? Outcast and what? Out. And who else? It's Outcast. Tribe, yeah, so Outcast, Outcast versus, versus Tribe. If he do that, that's, that's it. crazy. Yeah, too. Yeah, that's yeah. it. Like, yeah. like um, versus Shout to Q2. versus is bigger oh than God. versus. Is, I don't want to say bigger than hip hop, but it's. Well, it's huge. Yeah, it's huge. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, Gladys yeah. Knight and then, and then. I ain't gonna lie, I skipped that one, bro. Yeah. <laughs> so, uh, Brandy. I'll be liking a little bit of disrespect. Well, no, a little Brandy, bit yeah, Brandy, Brandy, Brandy and Monica. Monica. Brandy and Monica. I like a little bit of disrespect, man. Like, yeah. there was, there was it's too helping, respectful. It's yeah. helping their streams. Memes came out of that. Yeah. Like, you see, like, Brandy and Monica, obviously, they're, they're, they're hit artists right. in a different time. But, but it, it helped their streams in this time. So it's now dope, young it's kids are like, oh, Brandy and Monica. But it's like also like a, um, like a, like, but for what? Because if streams, you can't go on tour right now, and mm-hmm. you don't own those records. Mm-hmm. Right. It's also like a double double work for nothing sometimes. So you got to be careful, like you know what I mean. Um, that's why you see a lot of artists trying to play their new shits on the shits, like you know what I mean. You like, mm-hmm. like nigga, like I don't know, the I don't know that record, but <laughs> the niggas <laughs> like this shit got three million streams right, right, right now. Right, like right. like the world would know it afterwards. Right. Because, uh-huh. So sometimes it's. So I get I get the love of the culture. I get that. Don't trust me. I get it. I get the love of the culture. But you know, how much love are we really gonna have? And um um especially when it's corporations that's involved. You know what I'm saying? So all due respect and all love. But I feel like once it gets to that level of a Madison Square Garden or things like that, uh every every everyone should be paid. Not just the artist that's yeah. there. Every everything should be paid because this we're at that time now. This is hot for Rapper turn smack rapper. Only smack rapper that you know is smack rappers. Got bars, I can hang with the backpackers. Trap star, I don't hang with the backpackers. I'm in the hood with the work you heard. Making fiends leave earth, you heard. Got your baby mama thirst, you heard. Feel the flow, nigga, throw it in reverse. This the wave you need to surf, you heard. Told Jim I need a bomb, I could drop on you niggas. Bad boy, I'm never gonna stop for you niggas. I don't give a fuck who you got as the illest. I solidify my spot with gorillas. Now I'm rock with you niggas. Thank <laughs> you.